And finally, let's talk a little bit about the International Society for Individual Liberty, ISIL for short. Yeah. Uh, what would you like people to know about it? Well, it's an organization that started um, in the 1970s. Uh, Vince Miller and uh, Bruce Evoy, then later Jim Elwood, were ones who thought, well, there's a lot of libertarian foment here in the United States, but it's not getting to other countries very much. And they were interested in um, translating uh, free market work and making it available in other countries, and then to develop a network of people by having conferences every year in various countries, especially in Europe, but elsewhere too, and New Zealand and uh, Latin America and elsewhere, uh, and Africa. Um, so uh, I joined because I was very interested to help with this sort of thing. Little did I know that uh, this book would be one of their major projects and, and their network, the, one of the major ways for me to reach out and meet the people in other countries that are enthused about you know, publishing all these editions of the book. Um, and we still have a number of conferences. Uh, uh, one is coming up in Shanghai this uh, July that my wife is organizing. Uh, and uh, we're going to have a, a lineup of, right now we've already got 16 committed speakers for a, about a three-day conference in Shanghai. And uh, it's going to be all about Austrian economics and the biggest uh, the biggest economy and country in the world. I mean, uh, and by economy, uh, not yet, maybe second to number in the United there. States, but it's getting there and growing very, very strong, um, growing very fast. And it's still a communist uh, country, so yeah. it's uh, really quite a remarkable thing to get in uh, and start preaching. And actually, there are a lot of free market libertarian people in, uh, in China. They just have uh, been muzzled uh, to some great extent, and this is an opportunity to try and approach uh, more free market ideas there. And they've been doing it uh, with us last summer. We did it in Sicily. And we had a group from all around, all around Asia and Europe and Africa that came. Um, you know, that kind of work, that kind of event would really spark interest from, from libertarian groups of people in, in Western Balkans. Mm -hmm. Only if it were held closer to home. So actually, this last summer, my wife also organized uh, a week-long Austrian economic seminars in uh, Romania. And we had uh, talks in Bulgaria, which is uh, close to. Uh, but hopefully, yeah, we, we would be. And there was one uh, organization that held uh, the, these liberty camps for students in Albania uh, just this last summer. And more is going to be done. Um, and so we reach out. We invite people to, to talk to us about starting up these liberty camps throughout uh, Eastern Europe. And uh, hopefully it'll be right next door. We like to have these camps in the summer where students can get away and faculty and students uh, can mingle up in the mountains or at the seaside in a nice uh, friendly environment and they can talk and open and get to know each other really well. So we're, we're doing a lot of that. And that kind of reminds me to give you the praise for the International Society of Individual Liberty website because it has been very influential to our own project, Campaign for Freedom and Prosperity in Bosnia and Herzegovina, and also on our new project, uh, Freedom and Prosperity TV, that we, oh. are, that we are creating right now. Uh, it's been uh, very influential because it contains basically the blueprint of how to create organizations, how to start liberty movements around the world. And we, we have actually taken it from your, there's a section on um, uh, intellectual resources and tools for action. So we basically looked that up and, and used it. That's, that's excellent to hear. And we, need, we actually need more representatives in that part of the world. I hope that you'll be uh, in regular contact with us posting right. update stories of what's happening in your area. And this can be kind of a clearinghouse of ideas right. from all around the world. So that, right. that's great. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. We heard that you've already been in, in Western Balkans. The Bosnia stepping. And yeah, the yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, well, uh, my wife and family, my, my, that's my wife and daughter, we, we went to um, Belgrade to visit our good friends Tomislav Kuzmanovic okay. and um, uh, Misho Anjanovic and uh, uh, Richard uh, Danicek. Uh, they were former students of mine uh, here in, in Hawaii. Actually, I've got a lot of students uh, here who are from Ser Serbia, Alex and, and, uh, and Nada and others. Well, 
when we were there, Misho took us into the countryside to, uh, and then uh, Thomas Love took us over to the to the Drina River, and we spent uh, a couple nights there. Right on the border. And, right on the border, and so we got into a boat, a fishing boat, and and we went out on the, on the water, and they wouldn't let us have a visa over to Bosnia at that time, so uh, boldly we went to the to the shoreline, and I, I I took my shoe off and I put my foot on Bosnia, and I was there, and. Uh, uh, my friend who was in the boat at the time took my passport and marked in a little uh, designation that I've, that I've been to Bosnia now. At least I put my foot in Bosnia. Uh, someday I'm going to come back and, yeah, and do, do it, it properly. properly. <laughs> yes, awesome. Anybody took a picture of you? Uh, no, no. So that we can detain you. Yeah. <laughs> That's right. I'll make it uh, formal next time. I, I, I wanted to go to Macedonia. I have friends there and uh, Slovenia. Um, and, uh, uh, well, I, I, I'd like to go visit there with my family uh, again sometime and, and just spend a lot of time visiting throughout the countryside and, and to visit you. Maybe uh, we can absolutely. all tour together. <laughs> no, we really definitely need to work together yeah. on getting some, some events going. Great, great. Yeah, awesome. yeah. Well, this has surely been fun. Uh, Professor School, thank you for your time. Thank you very much. I really appreciate this. It's so good. I'm, we met on the Great Wall of yes, China, yes, we did. and now we ran run across each other here again. That's <laughs> right, what's fantastic. Right.